Ooh. And that is that's it for the that's it for that tool. So alrighty to so already today what we are going to do is we are going to go through the Milwaukee Black Friday sales. All right. So when it comes to the M12 sales in previous videos, when I did a walkthrough of the Black Friday sales at Home Depot, I said in multiple times that this is garbage. You can get these both for $120, uh, two twin power batteries, a charger and the two tools in a bag. All right, and so what I want to try to do is I want to try to show you the difference between these two and this. You can get this one for $100. This comes with a 2 amp hour battery charger and an M12 fuel bag. I guarantee you that this one will last a lot longer than these two will because it's brushless. There's less stuff. There's less mechanics inside to go wrong, and it runs smoother and more efficiently, and so the battery will actually last longer than the battery in these ones. All right, so that's my goal. We're gonna go through the specs of these really quick, uh, go through the deals, and then we're, I'm gonna show you the difference between the power of these two versus this one. All right, so the downfall of these two is this is just a drill and this is an impact driver. But with this, you get a hammer feature which you could drive through concrete. You can't do that with this. I wanna see if this could actually beat these both. We're, all, we're, we're gonna use two amp hour batteries uh, in all of them, they all are, they all are full. They all are full, and so let's go over the specs of these really quick uh, and the price difference, and let's get to it. Let's see if the Milwaukee M12 Fuel uh, brushless hammer drill can beat the two brush tools. Alrighty, so first we are going to do the M12 drill driver. Let's actually zoom out a little bit. Battery is full, two amp hour battery. Put it in drill. We're gonna try speed two. Let's see if we can do a six inch backs on speed two. Right here is good. All right, so ready, go. Nope, not even close. Not even close. Right, let's take it out. All right, let's do speed one. This is on speed one. All right, so ready, go. Time. Up oh, a little bit more. Time. It did it. All right, let's take it out. Ready, go. All right, let's do the same thing with the M12 fuel hammer drill. Ooh, that's, that's fast. All right, let's try it on speed two. Right here is good. All right, so ready, go. Oh, sorry, it's not a, it wasn't on drill. Let's redo that. Was not on drill. Right next to it, right there is good. All right, so ready, go. Nope, can't do it. All right, let's take it out. That's speed one. All right, so let's try that again right here. All right, so ready, it's on speed one. Oh, I'm sorry, battery is full. I didn't show you guys. All right, ready, go. Time. It did it. Uh, let's take it out. All right, ready, go. Time. All right, let's do... The same thing with the impact driver and let's uh with the brushed impact driver just to show you guys really quick the difference 
which I'll actually, I'll, I'm going to include this as well. All right, this is the difference between the brushed fuel, the brushless fuel, and the, brush, uh, the brushed. Significant difference in size. So this is also a $100 kit, just like the brushless fuel hammer drill. All right, so up, oh, battery is full. All right, so ready, go. Time, and I can tell you this, that the brushless fuel did that a lot faster than the brushed impact driver. I can tell that right. I might be wrong. I can tell, but I, it, it, it seemed like it did it faster. All right, so ready? Go. I can smell that. I can smell that. Yeah, the motor doesn't smell too... These are somewhat new as well because I barely use the brush tool. So, all right, so the battery is still full. Uh, let's try it on speed two. Let's see if this could actually do it. I'll be surprised if it can, but I doubt that it will. It's on drill, speed two. Ready? Go. <laughs> all right, that's where it cut out. That's where it cut out, right there. All right, so let's do the let's do the M12 fuel. All right, so ready, go. All right. And it did it all the way. It drove it in all the way. So let's actually have this uh, drive the rest of it in. It was able to. It struggled, but it was able to. Let's see if this is able to take it out on speed two. If not, we'll switch over to speed one. Ready? Go. Nope. Speed one is required. All right, so ready? Go. Time. Battery on this is uh, three bars. It might go back to four after it uh, resets a little bit. All right, so let's have the M12 fuel take its out. Let's see if we can do it on speed two. I doubt it. All right, ready? Battery is at three bars. Ready? Go. It can. Wow. Time. It was able to do it on speed two. That is powerful. So that is the time difference between what each tool is able to do. This one, like I said, this one is seriously powerful. This is worth the money that the other tools are able to do. So this one is worth, this one's worth the purchase. The two brush tools for 120 is not. Alrighty, so we are gonna use the brushed, uh, the brushed impact driver. Uh, we're gonna do a four inch by half inch lag. All right, so let's do one right here. All right, so ready, go. That it? A little bit more. Yep, that's it. Uh, the battery's at two bars. It'll probably go up after the battery cools off for a second. Let's see if 
the drill, uh, the hammer drill could drive in a, a four inch lag on speed one. I'll be surprised if it can. I've never done this before, so I'm actually curious if it can. I doubt it, 100% doubt it, but let's see. All right, so, ready, go. You can do it. Nope, it gave out. That's not bad, though. That's not bad. I'm like, for, for a drill, that is seriously powerful. All right, now it does depend on what battery you have. All right, I want to do one test really quick. I'm going to go get a higher amp hour battery. I want to see if it's able to do that. All right, so we have a six amp hour battery here, but let's take it out. Wow. Let's try that one more time in one more spot using the six amp hour battery. This, I will admit this is cheating a little bit because this cost uh, $120 itself, but this is just to show you later on in the future if you get a better battery, what this drill can do. All right, so ready, go. Almost. Yep, it did it. It drove it in all the way. All right, so I, I'm going to uh, put that time against the brushed impact driver, and we're also going to time taking it out. All right, so ready, go. That is powerful. That is powerful. And for the brushed impact driver that comes in that $120 kit, let's use this battery as well, just, just to be a little fair. All right, so... Ready. Battery is full. Ready. Go. Time. I can smell that motor. For the final comparison, let's talk about this. Let's talk about the, the chuck of the tool right here. All right. So like I said, this is a half inch chuck. All right, so that means you could put bits like this inside of it. And there you go. All right, just lock it in place. Then you're good to go. All right, so but, but when it comes to this chuck, you can't put something like this inside there. It doesn't fit. See? It, it, it just it just doesn't fit all right so first this is the milwaukee m12 brushed impact driver all right so this is model number 2562-20 12 volt system uh variable trigger only uh there is no speed selection on this so you're stuck with just pulling the trigger led light on the on the base this goes to 0 to 3,300 uh, impacts per minute and 0 to 2,500 RPM. All right, so it, it's a, it's this compared to the M12 fuel impact driver that you could also get for $100, this is garbage. All right, so to me, this is, I just, uh, I wouldn't use this for anything. I just use this for versus videos against other brushed tools, uh, 12 volt tools. So this is, it, to me, because of the new technology and it's actually cheaper than this, this is garbage to me. That, that's just my opinion. It's garbage. Well, like I said, the battery is full. Battery indicators on the body when it comes to the M12 system. All right, so this is the Milwaukee M12 drill driver. Two speed settings, 18 point clutch plus one, which uh, anything outside of drill mode is uh, just uh, screw. So this is model number 2407-20, 12 volt system, two speed settings, first speed zero to 400 RPM on speed two zero to 1500 RPM. Now that, that, that's actually pretty decent, but like I said, it is a brushed tool. It, it is a, a fully metal chuck and the downfall of this, it's a three eighths in chuck. You are limited to what you could put inside because it's three eighths. You want a half inch metal chuck. And that three eighths is a major downer, major downer. So like you're very limited to what you could put inside there. Very limited. Just to show you the difference in chuck sizes, 
half inch to three eighths inch. That is a huge difference. All right, so this is, this, it looks much better. It is a hammer feature, so you could use this on concrete. This is the Milwaukee M12 Fuel brushless hammer drill. This thing, this thing is a beast. All right, fully metal half inch chuck. All right, this is model number 2504-20, 12 volt system, uh, two speed settings. First speed is zero to 450 RPM on speed two, zero to 1700 RPM, which that is 200 RPM more than the brushed version. And this is not a hammer drill, it's a regular drill driver. This is a 16 point clutch plus two, which that is drill and hammer. Anything outside of drill and hammer is just screw, dry, is just screw where the clutch activates. And so, yeah. Now, look, just hear that sound. And then hear the sound of this. Very weak. Very weak. Yeah, uh, we are not going to test hammer mode because you can't do it uh, with the drill driver. So we're just going to pretty much test the power between these three. Now, like I said, this is $100 for the, for the kit. So, all right, so this is 120 but you do get an addition, uh, the benefit of this, you do to get an additional battery, uh, and that's pretty, and two tools. For $20 or more, you get an extra battery and another tool, but these tools will not last you nearly as long as this. So I still, no matter what happens in this video, I still recommend this, t th this tool. 100%, it's, it'll be a great gift for a loved one. It is uh, majorly underpriced right now because of the Black Friday sales. So if this is still available at your Home Depot, I'd buy it. Alrighty, so in my opinion, this kit for $120 is not worth it. Get this kit, because that's why I say brush tools are garbage, because a brushless tool that is very powerful doesn't really cost that much more than uh, a brush, an older brush tool. These will crap out on you a lot faster than this, would, this one would. So. That's what I suggest you get. I showed you the difference between these two, and I suggest you get the brushless fuel hammer drill or the brushless fuel impact driver. Either or, both of these are $100 kits with a two amp hour battery, charger, and a bag. Better than this one. Yeah, you get the free, you get the extra battery with this, but the tool is crap compared to this. So I'd go with the tool instead of the extra battery and the extra crappy tool. So. I just wanted to point that out to you guys to help you guys out, make, it, make your decision if you were on the threshold of buying either or, either one of these. So I just wanted to help you out with that just to, you know, show you what the difference is without actually spending your money. So if you found this video helpful and entertaining, please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos and please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time. <music>